He, he saw know how to get around in loopholes. Like all these businesses, like, you know, Walmart, Family Dollar right here. You know, they're doing all kind of shady shit on the books. Right. He saw a foul bankruptcy and transferred into his, his wife's name. And his son continued on. What is it? The country was literally founded by criminals for criminals. That's why if you're a rich white man, you go to court, you just throw a bunch of money at the situation and the problem goes away. This, this country is designed for criminals. But that criminal that he saw. It says strangers devour it in the present. And it is desolate and overthrown by strangers. Hi, Esau! <laughs> I gotta keep hitting up with the sign. Like. Stop it. You get that rush hour. What's up, douchebag? Somebody gonna see that sign, they gonna get mad. Like, oh, that's bullshit. When you come, you're looking at us like, like we're trying to teach you. evil ass spirit. They looking at us like, what's going on here? You know, they don't do no good. Yup. Mm -hmm. Hey, ain't nobody listening to y'all. It don't matter. They listening to us or not. Really good. Who did the scripture on that? Who said Ezekiel 1 or 2? Yeah, yeah. Ezekiel 3. It says, it says Ezekiel 3. Moreover, he said unto me, Son of man, all my words that I shall speak unto thee, receive in thy heart and hear with thy ears. You know, we receive it through the angels. It says, and go, get thee to them of the captivity and to the children of thy people, and speak unto them, and tell them, thus said the Lord power, whether they will hear, or whether they will forbear. Then the spirit will see us, Then I came to them of the captivity of Tel Aviv that dwelt by the river of Chabar, and I sat where they sat and remained there astonished among them seven days. And it came to pass at the end of seven days that the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore hear the word at my mouth and give them warning from me. This is for all of us, all the children of Israel. It's a warning, man. Warning that death and destruction is coming. Uh, turn him into a tranny. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, do you see that story down in Brazil? 
two le a lesbian couple. Oh, they, they cho chopped off the son's penis. Ooh. And then they got so sick of looking at him, they said his face reminded him of his father. So, so they ended up uh, chopped his head off and fucking poked his eyes out. Before all that, they even tried to sew his yeah. penis back on and shit. Chopped his dick off. Whoa, they tried to turn him into a train. That's horrible. Yeah. That's horrible, man. Yeah. You got it. That's a common though. I mean, they don't do. I won't put it past them, but these women, they, they encourage these boys to be trainees. Yes. I got a cousin that uh, she don't her, she don't turn her son into a homosexual, and they encourage it. They're like, oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. You know what I mean? He ain't had no father or nothing. Yeah. Well, that's good. But you know what? Uh, those islands just catch hell. Like 48 million motherfuckers in the dark. Oh, yeah, I see that. 48 million motherfuckers. They say all the power is off in uh, Venezuela or something. They all, they get hit all the time. But now the U.S. is fucking with Russia's electric grid, man. I wish they'd turn off this electric. <laughs> it's coming. That's why I'm saving the best for last. Motherfuckers think they're untouchable, man. That'd be so peaceful. They think they're untouchable, man. Just turn the lights off. If we get to hear the screams tonight, I'll be able to go to sleep. Right. We keep saying that they coming when the lights are off. You motherfuckers ain't coming back on, man. They ain't coming back on. And that one time they was off for a week, people was panicking. They were fucking fuck. It was chaos in the city, man. And we was lounging, kicking it. Chaos. That was beautiful, chaos. man. That was fun time. What right time there. to get light, man? To get light, the sun comes up at 6 o'clock now. Or early something as like fuck, that. Yeah. These bitches gonna wake up early looking for safety. <laughs> looking for a man, you know they what I'm saying? They ain't saying? staying up late no more. Yeah, they gonna be walking, get up early, and they gonna go to bed early. They gonna get in the house before the sun goes down. These lights, when they turn off, they ain't coming back home, motherfucker. These bitches gonna wake up early Shit. in the morning looking for a man in the morning. Right now, Jake don't wake up till then. 12, he almost crashed into that car. <laughs> you ever walk through the hood about even as late as 11 o'clock in the morning. Yeah, I'll be doing it. It'd be good. quiet as hell. It'd be quiet as hell. They don't be out till night. Who that? We know him. We might know him. I don't know. I don't fucking know. People be changing. They get on drugs. They look good. He looks so individual. The whole thing. What did you buy to read something? Yeah. It's uh, Jeremiah 1 and 1 uh, 14 slide. It says, The great day of Yahweh is near, it is near, and hasten greatly. Even the voice of the day of Yahweh, mighty man shall cry there bitterly. That day is a day of wrath, a day of trouble, and distress, a day of. All I gotta say, man, y'all do your shit over here, man. I see y'all everywhere, man. <laughs> That's what's up. See over here. Okay, I ain't got time right now. What'd he say? See, that's the best thing you can do. Give us, give us some credit. You know, just don't start. But what'd he say? That he said he sees us everywhere. He sees us everywhere. Well, we have been everywhere. And lately, the past month, the past yeah. month, we done hit up uh, a few spots. Yeah. The demon might be everywhere. That's good though, because they still teach people they Israelites, I that's guess. True, true. But the thing is, the bigger thing is he's seeing it, but he's not joining it. Right. Know? Yeah. He's not joining it. said my sheep hear my voice. The Lord actually said the sheep hear my voice in the You know? The voice of a stranger they will not follow. That's right. That's right. Who's singing that school song, baby? It's a day of wasteness. So this land, America gonna get wasted. It's gonna get burnt with fire. That, that thermonuclear destruction is coming. People think that shit a joke, man. You know? Like missiles don't exist. It's a joke till they see their ass on fire like a candle. Like a candle wick. So you can't be forgetting about them missiles. They just, you know what I mean? That's what you call a game changer right there. Misses, motherfucking misses. It's gonna be used. Fuck out of here.
the missiles. That shit is amazing. I got a missile scripture too. Uh, a day of darkness and gloominess. A day of clouds and thick darkness. A day of darkness and gloominess. I mean, shit gonna get crazy out here, man. Even before the missiles gonna be crazy. <laughs> the people think that this, uh, the economic system is gonna go on forever. America, they think America's gonna stay prosperous. You know what I mean? That's, that's, you will live in fantasy land. That's fantasy land. Here, this, this is not prosperous. Look at this, this shit, this shit is trash out here. Right. Does this look prosperous? Fuck this shit is fucking trash and filth. That debt is coming. Hi, hi, hi. These motherfuckers is delusional out here. They delusional. They say every, every individual now holds like, it's like 150,000 each. Man, yeah, that's crazy. And these people want to collect. He saw wants to collect from that too. Even though it's impossible every individual thing. Even the fraction of that. Hey, China he saw want, wants to collect anyway. China want to collect. Hell yeah. They owe China a lot of money. But he's trash, driving a trash can. Driving a trash can. I missed him. Damn. Damn it. Oh, that bitch got guns in her fucking shit. Damn. Oh, hood ass white bitch. Hey, there's some badass hoes out here. Hell yeah. You know, you look at some of them hoes, you can tell, oh, they can rank. A you are right according to this world. A, a, a little better. Education. Yeah. You know, good skin. You know? Their parents taught them not to steal and to be an ass, not be the asshole. Right, right. Skin be looking with not a real blemish on them and shit. Damn. Hey, some of these hoes is gonna get saved, you know. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna need some we're gonna need some women in the kingdom shit. <laughs> it ain't gonna be all men getting saved, yeah, okay. that's for sure. Like the most India and Pakistan ain't killing a lot of the females. That's it. Women from middle books, somebody. They find out it's a female. That's, that's fucking evil. Kill the boys. Kill the I mean, just set up a plan. They'd be like, hey, we got so many women, we're going to have to start distributing them. You know, you get two, you get, you get two. You know? But there's a lot of people in India, too. That's a Over a million? No, it's like over a billion. India? Yeah, it's like a... You know, Pakistan uh, India is the second most populated country in the world, uh, next Russia. to China. Yeah, because Russia just signed a deal, a, a military pact with uh, India. It's India. Well, they, they probably mentioned a city. It's probably a city. Yeah, oh yeah, I believe that one city could have that many, I believe. Yeah. It's a lot of people. I'd be afraid to go to India. All that, all that fucking devil worshiping down there. Hey, you ever seen that traffic? They don't be having street lights and shit. It's just a free for all when you're driving. But they about to fight, ain't they? You know, Jake you talks tell aggressive. Yeah, Jake. Jake talks aggressive. He does. Like, a, like his confrontation. Yeah. It could be just That's about. That's how you know there's a Jake. Yeah. <laughs> there ain't no fucking eat him. Oh, shit. Hey, that's spiritual right there. Joel 2 and 1, hold you the trumpet in Zion. Sound an alarm in my holy mountain. Let all the inhabitants of the land tremble for the day of the Lord coming. The day of the Lord is nigh ahead. That's what we've been saying out here. We've been telling people the day of the Lord is near. Hey, that's what the Lord said. You're supposed to tell these fools to repent. Because the kingdom of heaven is at hand. So you're supposed to tell the Israelites. Hey, let me get that real quick. That's right. I hope this. What's that? Matthew 10, ain't it? Matthew 10 and 5. These 12 years, how shall I set forth commanded us, saying, Go not into the way the Gentiles and any into any city the Samaritans enter ye not, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Go to Israel, not all nations. As ye go, preach, saying, the kingdom of heaven is at hand. 
So that's why we preach that the kingdom's at hand. So that means this kingdom got to be destroyed. That's right. But this shit, when we get in the kingdom, I mean, ain't going to be no America. Ain't going to be no America. Ain't going to be no United Kingdom. Ain't going to be no Russia, no France, no Pope, no Vatican. None of that SR shit also are going to be destroyed. That's a beautiful, that's a beautiful thing. That's something you got assholes in the churches. They teach that America is the kingdom. And they'll say, oh, America is the apple of God's eye. This is the holy new Jerusalem. They're going to they get destroyed. Right. The scriptures mention what you said. Exactly what you said. Uh, unclean frogs. Let me see. Let me find them. <laughs> hey, these people are unclean frogs. You want three unclean? Yeah. Revelations? Yep. These motherfuckers, they're unclean frogs. A bit, uh, one of these bitches open their mouth up and uh, frogs is jumping out. Snakes and salamanders is leaping out. <laughs> Fucking roaches is jumping out of their mouth when they open them. Fucking rats. That's why the scripture said their mouth is an open sepulcher. Death come out their mouth. Oh yeah, is this thing still going? Revelation 16. And the sixth angel, 16 and 12. And the sixth angel poured out his vial upon the great river Euphrates, and the water there was dried up, that the way of the kings of the east might be prepared. And I saw three unclean spirits like frogs come out of the mouth of the dragon. And out of the mouth of the beast, the mouth of the cross of And that dragon, that's talking about the beast, which is America and NATO, with America the head of it. That's that filthy whore that rides that beast and controls that beast. I'll go ahead. Right. For they are the spirit of devils, working miracles which go forth into the kings of the earth and of the whole world to gather them to the battle of that great day of the most of our life. Oh, I still got that scripture in the that's it. But that, like you said, that America would represent their military mount Washington, D.C. It's weird to say. It's not but you see that cloud down there? It like a little Oh, mountain. shit, yeah. It looks kind of strange, though. That is weird. I don't know. I mean, that just looks weird. That does look weird. Let's see if I get that some. That just looks weird. Let me get that some bitch on camera. I can't even see it right here. I got to guess where it's at. Where's that tree at? Where's that light pole? I'm trying to get a reference. I can't see it if I'm pointing at it or not. Where's that part? I was supposed to pick up a fucking sign. I was talking about a bigger telescope the other day and fucking forgot, man. I'm mad at the deal. Of course, you know, um, Esau loves us, the, the, the planets and shit. You know, you know Jupiter. They worship. They actually pray to that shit. Well, Jupiter, Jupiter is going to be close as fuck to the Earth right now. These are, these devils are saying that you're going to be able to see the rings with your naked eye, man. Or the moons. And that's some mind-boggling shit. It's going to be that fucking close. So I'm thinking these devils got some plan around that, you know? Well, you know why? That's Jupiter is probably their top guy because it's the biggest planet. Yeah, yeah. So expect some. The devil, he's just, he's an opportunist, man, and he believes in that shit. So it's, it might be another opportunity for him to do some dirt. You know? They're going to have to make some sacrifices to Jupiter. That's right, that's right. So keep your eyes open for that. You know, and people think that, send it out for you. And people think that a joke, though. They say, oh, sacrifice. They make a sacrifice. What right. do you think the right. ancient Romans was doing? Right. They made so many sacrifices to Jupiter and ancient Rome that all the ashes turned into a mountain. Yeah. And America is the Roman Empire reincarnated. They use all the same Roman architecture. Rome, they got a Senate just like Rome and all that. That's right, that's right. People think shit sound crazy. Oh, y'all crazy. Okay, back to Joel 2. The day of darkness and of gloominess. Is this you want to say something else on that though? Okay. Well, let's Jupiter shit. Oh, what on that? Roman Empire shit? Well, look on the back of a dollar bill. You got an eagle on the back of a dollar. That represents Jupiter. The eagle is a symbol of Jupiter. Uh, that's why uh, the, the American symbol is the eagle. That go back to ancient Rome and the worship of Jupiter. 
And that's why he's saying, God, we trust in a dollar. That's talking about Jupiter. Because Jupiter is just a Roman version of Baal. Okay? They, they ain't calling Baal in Rome. They call him Jupiter. The Sky Father. Okay? He's the Sky God. The planet of Jupiter. Oh, shit. Another one, too. Capitol Hill in Washington, D.C. is named after Cap uh, Capitol Lean Hill in ancient Rome. And guess what was in Capitol Hill in ancient Rome? The Temple of Jupiter. So you ain't gonna tell me we don't know what we're talking about. We in some interesting times, man. We in some interesting times. So yep. like I said, keep up, keep your eye open for this. So that is that crazy. Thing. Right. So that thing with Iran's popping off right now, right when Jupiter is getting is the largest it's been in many years. Um, this is um, Isaiah 47 13. Thou art worried in the multitude of thy counsel. Let now the astrologers, the stargazers, the monthly prognosticators stand up and save thee from these things that shall come upon thee. <laughs> That's in witchcraft. Yeah, because America's ran by Freemasons. It was founded by Freemasons. When America was formed, it was formed by Freemasons. Well, they called themselves the Sons of Liberty, and they all met up in secret in Freemasonic lodges to conspire against the King of England. I mean, everybody that George Washington was a Freemason, okay, the first president. He's a known, well, uh, uh, famous free, the most famous of them all, perhaps, beside Albert Pike. Oh, and even Albert Pike said what? He predicted that there would be three world wars. Woo! So he still had this plan a long time. Yeah, he got this shit planned. Right, he had a plan long Well, they know it was in the scriptures. That's right, that's right. Cause you know the, it's the most high that got these guys. Yeah. Yep, he got them programmed. <laughs> Three world wars. Hey, like we always say here in Columbus, there's a there's fucking Freemasonic lodges all over the fucking place. They got oh, there's one right by my house at Shriner Lodge, right by my house. Oh, I shouldn't even said that. They gonna come after me. They be looking up Shriner on Google Maps. Oh, I gonna say where that. The motherfuckers is everywhere though. They are. They everywhere. Ain't hey, 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 Oh yeah. They're everywhere. Oh, that children's hospital. We talking about why we got all these sick children. Children's hospitals ran by Shriner. You know that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Freemasons. Up in here somewhere, there's a plaque. There's an actual big ass poster. Uh, I'm trying to think of what it actually says. Uh, 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 we need to go over there and scope it out one day. I can't remember where the fuck is. I know where it is though. We gotta go to the fifth floor. Oh, it's in the hospital? Yeah, it's in the fucking hospital. And you just walk around? This is the floor they dedicated to Jack Faggot Nichols. Oh, it's fucking It's some amazing shit, man. You got wild. Whole floor dedicated to Jack Oh, well, Jack Nicholas is a Columbus legend. Uh, no. Jack Nicholas hated him. That was before my time. Jack fucking Nicholas. All I know is Tiger. And my man, what's my man? My dude, my favorite golfer. What's up with your boy? Always smoke cigarette, John Daly. He be drunk. He be drunk as hell. Out there drunk. That was my dude, bro. Out there drunk as fuck. How he was making all that money and not winning is just mind boggling. Crazy. That's amazing. It says, Behold, they shall be as stubble. Let me start back up to 13. Thou art worried in the multitude of thy counsels, but now the astrologers, the stargates, the monkey prognosticators, stand up and say to thee, all these things that shall come upon thee. Behold, they shall be as stubble. The fire shall burn them. They shall not deliver themselves from the power of the flame. Therefore, there shall not be a coal to warm at nor a fire to sit for. Thus shall they be unto thee with whom thou hast labored, even thy mercies and thy youth. They shall come here and watch his quarters. None shall save thee. Ain't no saving America. It's not possible. You know, you people are asked, the, asked that question. Oh, how can we save it? How can we save it? Ain't no saving this place. Why would you want to save it to begin with? Right. You don't turn this Hell no. You can't fix it. Like the community. How are you going to supposed to fix the community? They just read it. With fire, you're gonna burn that shit up. Right. That's the Heavenly Father's plan on fixing the computer by destroying it. That's the cure. <laughs> burn it. Burn it. Back to Joel 2 and 2. It's like a hanging. Right. A day of darkness and gloom. A 
day of clouds and thick darkness as the morning spread upon the mountain. A great people and a strong, there have not been ever the like. Neither shall be any more after it, even to the years of many generations. But what do you call those uh, catapults where they shot rocks on fire with uh, tra That thing they call trabuchet. Right, or something. there's some that shoot arrows. Yeah. A whole tree, a whole tree That's made into an arrow, man. That ain't that's shit. That's some bad shit. Yeah, it is bad for some ancient shit. Yeah, for some ancient shit. It's a nuclear missile that's guided and rushes change directions. Man, that's on some whole. It says they got nuclear power missiles now. They can just stay in the sky. It's continuously It's continuously circle. It says there hath not been ever the like. Neither shall be any more after it, even to the years of many generations. So after these nuclear missiles are used, that's it. They're going to serve their purpose. They're going to use all the missiles. Oh, all no. They're going to be one safe. You know Esau in his bunkers and shit. He probably going to have a few in his bunkers. <laughs> so crazy, man. A few in his bunkers where he's saying that. Come out and terrorize the world. That's what this devil's intentions are. That cop had a look of uh, amazement on his face. <laughs> right. He said, oh, I mean, come on. Look where he's coming. He used to see him. Yeah, he used to see him. a better job of policing than them. Way better. Way better. He, they look at us while we're still here standing in great boldness? Shit. These cops, that's funny. All the, almost all the Columbus cops are all fucking Edomites, too. You notice that, right? That's amazing. Bunch of goddamn devils. That's amazing shit. Them motherfuckers are terrorists. But that's good, though. The most hot set the cops up to punish you people. Wicked, who was thy sword? It says, A fire devoureth before them and behind them as flame burneth. The land is as the garden of Eden before them and behind them a desolate wilderness. All yeah. right, yeah, because in the kingdom of heaven is going to be like the garden of Eden. It's going to be a beautiful, lush paradise. Not this bullshit. We live in a concrete jungle, got trash all over the fucking place. Fucking whores, drug addicts. Oh. Yeah, this shit is really, this is really trash out here. Like, who the fuck would want to live in this shit? And you got assholes that live in this field talking about, I'm proud to be an American. Be crying and shit when somebody sing the national anthem. You know what I'm saying? Especially when your boy uh, Ray Charles came out. Oh, beautiful. That shit made you want to <laughs> Man, Ray you Charles. Don't like it. Yeah. You make you feel a certain way. <laughs> Ray Charles, the way he's saying it, bro, you thought America really was beautiful. Woo! He sang the hell out of that goddamn song. Good. I ain't even acting for real. That was my dad's favorite singer, Ray Charles. Look at that shit. You're gonna throw the fuck up, man. For real. It's always Jake singing the song too. The best rendition. Yep. Whitney Houston yep. sang the best yep. national anthem in history. Yep. Always Jake singing that shit. Jose hey. and Carl. Bro. Oh, she got. You remember that? One? She got pelted. <laughs> Until she's still getting uh, taking good shit for that. She don't know how to keep her mouth shut. She's that's, back on the scene again. I tell you, she a Jake. She cause. She ain't gonna shut up. You know, she she lost her show. She's still talking shit. Always love those Yeah. Always like her. Always like her. Hey, that show was some real shit. Yeah. It looked like they're really living in the hood. Yeah, she's always been just, just that type of person, just a real bitch. Yep. Just a real ass bitch. Keeping it good. Keeping it good. It says. It says. This ain't going forever. Yeah, and nothing shall escape them. The appearance of them is as the appearance of horses and a horseman, so shall they run. All right, that's talking about the missiles. But when the missiles hit, that fire, the way it's going to be running. Once that missile hit, it's going to go boom, and then it's going to shoot, that fire going to shoot out, and that fire going to look like horses running. You know what I mean? That's going to be beautiful, man. You know, when the horses run, that sound. 
Yep. That amazing sound. Dude, they gonna hear that gallop. Yep. Yep. Oh, shit. Hey, the four horsemen. Uh-oh, let me move this out of his way. Oh, you good? You gonna hear them scriptures? Uh oh. Nope. Hey, hey. Warning. That was the warning. You gotta come back and listen. Hey, that, everything's spiritual. Or shit follows. He's like, I ain't playing with it. <laughs> what oh, we're talking shit. about, we're just talking about the construction of this place, man, which is all in the scriptures. You know, Babylon. You ever heard America referred to as Babylon? Or, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, or Egypt. It's, it's this place is going out by fire. And right now, what we're reading in Joel 2 is. How it's going to be destroyed by thermonuclear missiles. Well, let's start back. I do that thing It says, Joe, I'm going to start back at day uh, two and two. A day of darkness and gloominess, a day of clouds and thick darkness as the morning spread upon right. the mountains. Right, because the church is to have you believe when the Lord comes back, it's going to be all peace, rainbows, sunshine. The Lord finna bring destruction to the earth. He finna all this out here. He not people always talking about we need to clean up the community, fix the community. The Lord going to fix the community. He gonna burn it with fire. That's how you clean it up. <laughs> this this place is this need to be destroyed. That's the only solution. Yeah. They gotta go. I, I know it's gonna come back with fire. But it's, gonna, uh, it's not gonna shut it no more. Right. Right. And that was the covenant with the rainbow that right. the Lord made yep. with his people. Right. Yeah, yeah you're right. Right. But the second death is fire. Yep. Yeah, and the Bible called that the second death. That that's what you call the lake of fire. The lake of fire. The, only a few gonna get saved. The scripture says a few will be saved. Right. And the ones that get saved, we're gonna get beamed up in the chariots. And when you look down into uh, America, you're just gonna see a lake of fire. That's those that get saved. Right. But those that get saved actually look down from those UFOs that the Lord's gonna come and deliver us here. Looking down. Wow. This place is gonna be, this is it, man. This can't, this man just can't go on. Can't forever, continue, man. man. You know, we live in, this is hell. You happy? Right, right. You happy? I'm, I'm, I'm thankful that I'm still here. Well, yeah, right. But you want to be thankful that you're still here pushing this truth, though. Right. Learning this right. truth, right. being under the grace. I, I, I do speak on it. Not like I should. Right. But I do pass it on, like, to my son. You know, things like that. I do. I'm not sad. I'm not as where I want to be. Right. But you know, I, but I you know what? Them. When you punish your children, you want your children to be on punishment, happy and, and you know, and joyful. That's the same thing with us. We ain't supposed to be here prospering and being happy and, and well, waking we ain't, up. What we the never fuck are you changing for? You look yeah. at some of these people and they ain't got no reason to be smiling, but they're smiling. A lot of them, like our people, you want to call that Stockholm Syndrome. But to these other people, those other nations, man, them devils, man, they are here to oppress us. They're supposed to be smiling. But our people, we have no business. We ain't got no reason to be smiling. Unless you in this truth. That's just it. Unless you in this truth, those, uh -huh. those in this truth. We see the end of this whole thing. The end of this whole theater being played out. Because this we're in a we're in a stage, we're in a theater. A stage. And this the Heavenly Father's looking down watching this all play out. Do these prophecies. Because the prophets prophesied about America being destroyed. It's all just been played out, you know what I'm saying? But we're supposed to be here having Ecclesiastes 7. I got his guy right here. Oh, okay, y'all. Okay, uh. Because like I said, you're going to whoop your up. I mean, well, oh, when my kids, if I heard them, and they I send them to their room, and I hear them in there playing, I would go in there and give them another ass whoop. That's what I used to do. So they got to the point that when I put them to punish, they made sure they were punished, you know? They police themselves because they ain't want me coming back in there. Right. It's the same thing with Heavenly Father, man. Our people are catching hell and don't even know why they're catching hell. Don't even know why. It's all because of the Heavenly Father. Man. I got you. Uh, Ecclesiastes 7 and 7. Surely oppression maketh the wise man mad and a gift destroyed from heart. And that's what we are. We are oppressed people. We're the same part. Here is right here. It's just these people, man. That's it. We're oppressed people, man. Oh, yeah. You know? All these taxes and shit, all these austerities right. that we're paying and shit. We came to, it's so hard to uh, buy a cash car these days. Not just uh, finance, fuck finance the car. It's hard to even buy a cash car. It's hard to even get a bank account. You know what I'm saying? Right. You gotta have IDs, and money up here. That's what you call a question. Fucking paying child support to these uh, gorgeous ass filthy bitches, man. When the kids belong, according to the scriptures, the kids belong to us. 
You know, when they when they separate in the ancient world, that bitch was thrown out the house without the kids, without even closing that bitch's back, man. But we gave her clothes to go on. You know? Your marriage is supposed to be uh what do they say till death do us part? <laughs> That's what they say. They don't, you know what I mean? That's what they say. They take that oath, they don't fall by, by the oath. Hell, hell, hell. But yeah, man, these motherfuckers are selling out, man. You motherfuckers that are uh, prospering and succeeding in this world and want to vomit that shit on you to do the same goddamn thing. Like the scripture says, oppression make a wise man mad and a gift destroyed the heart. Or people will sell out for any goddamn thing, man. For any goddamn thing. Sucking dick, bending over, taking, getting a fist in the ass and shit just so they can say, they got, I got a million dollars in their account. Shit, man, you be a, your mouth will drop if you find out what these niggas is doing like Michael Jordan. Denzel Washington, your mouth is, oh shit, what's the scripture say? It's a shame, the uh, scripture says. Yeah, uh, Ephesians, uh, I mean, Ephesians 5. Is, is it Ephesians 5? Yeah. I gotta change this battery. Real quick, I'm gonna read this real quick. It's uh, Psalms 13, because you said uh, uh, you're, you're, you're just uh, thankful to be alive, right? 